didn't make a fuss, didn't publicly rebut or respond sarcastically. Elon Musk simply watched silently as a cattle executive mocked Tesla, saying he doesn't know how to make batteries. But what came next was a real punch in the gut for the industry. The unveiling of an aluminum ion battery with a supercapacitor, which not only challenges everything previously believed about electric batteries, but also promises to end the lithium ion era once and for all. With one, one, zero to wo weichach ki chai ki jiri. It simply doubles the energy density of traditional batteries. And most surprisingly, it only takes 19 eat to 10 minutes to fully recharge, which seems closer to filling up with gasoline than charging an electric car. Time, which has always been the greatest enemy of electric vehicles, is now becoming their ally. No one would need to wait 45 minutes at a charger anymore. With this technology, all they would need to do is park, grab a coffee, and return with a full battery. And that's no exaggeration. Tesla is already preparing this innovation for the Model 2, scheduled for release in 2026. Even more intriguing is what's behind it all. A fusion battery and super capacitor system that balances performance and durability like never before. Each element seems designed for extreme efficiency, and the difference begins to show in the early numbers. While lithium batteries typically last 1,500 to 2,000 charge cycles, this new version can handle up to 15,000 cycles, which represents more than 25 years of use intense without significant loss of performance. This means the battery can outlast the car itself. Instead of a disposable part, it becomes a long-lasting, highly reliable component. And unlike current batteries, which require complex cooling systems, this one can operate smoothly a 50 degrees C, a Paul 150 degree, even in the most brutal extremes of the planet, without suffering from overheating or freezing. Now, think about the weight this reduces from the vehicle's structure. Without the need for sophisticated cooling systems, the car becomes lighter, simpler, and cheaper to produce. This is where the financial impact comes in that few are prepared to face. The new battery can reduce costs by up to 75%. A pack that today costs around use 15,000 could drop to less than use four dollars mill. This brutal price reduction completely changes the game. Suddenly, that distant dream of an affordable electric car for everyone no longer seems so unattainable. Beyond the economy, there is another strategic issue that this technology surgically solves. Lithium dependence. Currently, 70% of the world's lithium reserves are concentrated in just three countries, and 85% of refining is dominated by China. This created a huge geopolitical vulnerability for the West. Aluminum, on the other hand, is abundant, widely distributed, and recyclable. The United States, for example, produces more than 0.27 million tons of aluminum per year. And more, 95% of aluminum can be recycled indefinitely without loss of performance. We are talking about a local, sustainable, and highly scalable solution. From an industrial perspective, the adoption of aluminum doesn't just mean mineral independence, it revolutionizes battery production. Because aluminum allows for a simpler structure and a faster production process, Tesla is designing an assembly line with less complexity, fewer stages, and higher speed. This also means fewer logistical bottlenecks, fewer critical inputs, and faster delivery. Mass production ceases to be a challenge and becomes a significant competitive advantage. The impact goes far beyond the numbers. When a technology drastically reduces charging time, slashes costs, extends lifespan by decades, and even eliminates geopolitical dependence, it's not just improving what already exists. It's creating a new product category. The Model 2, with this battery, is no longer just a car. It becomes a game changer in electric mobility, a tool that combines energy independence, affordability, and performance in a single package. And for the first time, this doesn't feel like a futuristic promise. Hidden within the internal structure of this new battery is a component as tiny as it is powerful. 
Graphene quantum dots, or graphene quantum dots, are microscopic particles, a thousand times smaller than the diameter of a human hair, that play an absolutely vital role in the functioning of this innovation. They're not there by chance. Each dot is strategically positioned to form an invisible mesh that prevents the formation of dendrites, those tiny needles that, in lithium batteries, can cause short circuits and premature degradation. In practice, it's as if these dots were tiny electronic guardians keeping everything under control. And the most surprising thing is that all this stability happens with just one gram of graphene quantum dots per battery. It seems absurd that such a small amount can make such a difference, but that's the point. The atomic scale has the power to completely transform the efficiency of a system. These points reduce 95% internal electrical resistance, which means much less energy is wasted as heat. Instead of heating the surrounding air, the battery delivers more power directly to the wheels. And this extra energy translates into real, noticeable performance, both in acceleration and range. Another direct impact of this quantum dot layer is on charging speed. By channeling electrons more efficiently, it enables higher energy transfer rates, up to 10 times faster than current batteries. That's why the Model 2 can be charged in minutes, without the risk of overheating that typically accompanies fast charging. The secret lies in the precision with which graphene quantum dots control the flow within the cell, keeping everything stable even under high demand. This is the difference between a battery that merely promises and one that truly delivers. This technology also solves one of the biggest problems plaguing electric car manufacturers, degradation over time. Quantum dots act as a support structure that reinforces the cell's internal stability, slowing chemical aging. This means less capacity loss over the years and less need for replacement. Simply put, it's as if the battery learned to preserve its youth, and this completely changes the cost-benefit equation for the consumer, who now has a car with consistent performance for more than two decades. But perhaps most impressive is that this technology isn't confined to labs or academic theses. Tesla has already validated graphene quantum dots in pre-production prototypes, meaning they've already undergone real-world testing in road conditions. It's not a concept awaiting approval. It's a system ready for scale. While other companies are still struggling in the early stages, dealing with high production costs and manufacturing bottlenecks, Tesla is already organizing its entire supply chain to implement this in real-time global scale from 2026. And that changes everything. Industrially, graphene dots also offer a rare advantage, are cheap, lightweight, and highly versatile. Its production can be integrated with existing steps in the battery manufacturing process without requiring major restructuring. This makes implementation faster, less costly, and safer. Tesla won't need to reinvent its assembly line, just update key points, which further accelerates the timeline. And of course, this speed is what can put the company many steps ahead of its competitors. The great irony is that because they're invisible to the naked eye, graphene quantum dots represent a kind of silent revolution. They don't make noise, they don't have flashy designs, and they don't appear in commercials. But they're what transform this battery into something unprecedented, one that can withstand thousands of cycles, charges in minutes, and doesn't lose power over time. It's the kind of technology few see, but everyone feels when they drive a car with it. And perhaps that's precisely what makes it so valuable. If the battery's body is impressive, its brain is even more surprising. Inside the Model 2, Tesla has included something that goes far beyond a simple controller, a proprietary neural chip called QNP1, responsible for interpreting the driver's biometric signals and optimizing the battery in real time. This module installed under the center console and connected directly to the car's sensors, is capable of predict up to 85% of driving patterns before the driver even touches the wheel. It analyzes data such as route history, eye movements, 
and even muscle tension to adjust the car's performance to the driver's physical and emotional state. The level of personalization offered by this system completely transforms the driving experience. If the chip detects that the driver is relaxed, it softens the suspension, throttle response, and even the cabin lighting. If it senses stress, the car responds more firmly, ready for more aggressive and precise driving. The Model 2 reacts not only to the driver's inputs, but also to their mood and body. It's as if, instead of controlling the car, the driver is in tune with it, like two organisms adjusting their rhythms. This symbiosis is not just comfort. It directly impacts energy efficiency and battery longevity. The QNP1 adapts charging and discharging modes based on individual usage patterns, optimizing each cycle. Instead of always charging the same way, the system learns when fast charging is best and when it's safer to slow down. This reduces battery wear by up to 30% and even improves everyday autonomy. In the long run, this could mean hundreds of additional life cycles, all done automatically without the driver even noticing. Another fascinating detail is how the QNP1's artificial intelligence works during driving. Sensors throughout the cabin detect micro-expressions, pupil dilation, and variations in steering wheel feel to predict whether the driver is about to accelerate or brake suddenly. This allows the battery to enter pre-charging or instantaneous energy release mode. Milliseconds before the action happens, the result? An immediate, delay-free response that improves the sense of control and makes the car more agile and intuitive. And what's more, the system is dynamic even when charging. During testing, Tesla demonstrated how the Model 2 adapts its energy flow based on the driver's hand pressure, eye brightness, and even nostril flaring, signals that indicate anxiety or haste. Instead of always charging at the same rate, the car adjusts the charging power according to perceived intent. If it detects the owner is in a hurry, it releases maximum charge. If it senses calm, it prioritizes battery preservation. It's a new level of human-machine interaction. This type of customization goes beyond aesthetics and enters the field of emotional performance. Tesla calls this biometric adaptive performance, a mode in which the car understands the driver's emotional state and adapts its driving style in real time. On stressful days, the Model 2 transforms into a sports car, firm and agile. On calm days, it becomes a serene, almost meditative vehicle. Transitioning between modes doesn't require buttons, menus, or apps. Everything happens fluidly, as if the car were sensing what the driver needs. And while other vehicles offer pre-programmed driving profiles, sport, economy, comfort, the Model 2 simply creates the ideal mode for you at that moment. It doesn't wait for a command. It reacts first. This elevates the driving experience to an almost organic level, where the machine not only responds, but also anticipates, learns, and cares. A car that understands you without you saying a word. With the right infrastructure, thousands of connected Model 2s could stabilize entire power grids. In large cities, where peak consumption causes blackouts or increases energy costs, these vehicles could inject power back into the system for a few minutes, relieving pressure on transformers. According to estimates, urban electric vehicle fleets like this could absorb up to 12% of the total network load in critical moments. And all this without compromising the driver's mobility, who would continue using the car normally after the momentary supply? And how is this possible? Precisely because of the absurd charging speed and thermal resilience of this new battery. While lithium batteries degrade outside the 20 to 30 Gribos Cedar Uadri Point, Dagri Huadsi Point range, the aluminum ion battery maintains performance even at temperatures ranging from 50 to plus 180 degrees Cedri, without the need for dedicated cooling or heating systems. This reduces the car's weight and production costs, but most importantly, allows operation in any climate in the world, from Alaska to the United Arab Emirates, without compromising energy performance. 
With a load that takes less than 10 minutes, user behavior also changes. Charging a car is no longer an event and becomes as casual as recharging your cell phone at work. This change in habit, although seemingly small, has a huge psychological effect. It eliminates the fear of autonomy and opens up new possibilities for use. Instead of planning trips around charging stations, drivers start Taos the car as an extension of the home power grid. Even exporting energy to your home or selling the surplus to the utility company. This logic also redefines the role of the car in remote or unstable regions, where access to energy is limited or subject to frequent blackouts. Imagine small towns, villages, or areas affected by natural disasters, where electricity is cut off for hours or days. A Model 2 could act as emergency power source, providing electricity to keep lights on, charge cell phones, power refrigerators, or even power small medical equipment. In this scenario, the car stops being just transportation. It becomes urban resilience device. And that's where Elon Musk's long-term vision comes in, autonomous fleets. When you combine the fast response battery with smart sensors and advanced navigation systems, you create a perfect ecosystem for autonomous taxis vehicles that can run all day, recharge in minutes, withstand thousands of cycles without degradation, and still serve as energy assets. The operating costs of such a fleet plummet, and the benefits increase for both companies and users. And most importantly, a new standard of urban transportation is created, cheaper, more efficient, and energy integrated. The versatility of this technology also makes it extremely attractive for commercial and logistics fleets, who need reliable vehicles with low maintenance costs and high uptime. Thermal resistance allows operation at any latitude and recharge time reduces downtime in depots. That's why analysts already predict massive adoption of this platform in emerging countries, where extreme weather conditions and infrastructure limitations challenge traditional electric vehicles. It sounds like science fiction, but it's already in pre-production. A battery that not only delivers power, but thinks, adapts, and even heals itself. The Model 2 battery core functions almost like a biological organism. When stressed by heavy use or rapid charging, aluminum particles migrate automatically to seal internal microcracks, while lithium ions maintain a dynamic protective layer called solid electrolyte interface, which renews itself with each cycle. This prevents natural cell degradation and exponentially increases the system's lifespan. And it doesn't stop there. Instead of slowly going to sleep when not in use, as current batteries do, the Model 2's goes into deep sleep mode. In this state, it reduces its internal activity by up to 90%, preserving 95% charge for more than six months. When it is reactivated, it awakens in less than half a second with full power available. This feature is ideal not only for occasional drivers, but also for extended storage situations, parked fleets, and even military or emergency use, where every second matters. Battery behavior also changes with the environment. In cold climates, the system prioritizes the use of aluminum ions, which are more stable at low temperatures. In hot regions, lithium ions take the lead, offering better performance with less heat generation. This is possible thanks to a built-in artificial intelligence algorithm 